European plane maker Airbus hasn't yet launched its Airbus A330neo yet. Frankly, we don't even know what the name of this airplane is going to be. Neo, as we have always come to understand it, is Airbus's adaptation of a new engine offering or option. So it looks like the A330 will be getting new, new engines at some point. We just don't know when the air formal uh, launch of this airplane is going to be. What we do know is that the airplane will have all new Rolls-Royce Trent 7000 engines. Before today, we didn't even know the name of, of this engine or any details about it. What's interesting about this particular engine is that it's the same engine that Rolls-Royce developed for the 787 Dreamliner. So Rolls-Royce is going to be supplying engines to both Boeing and Airbus for airplanes that compete head to head with one another. Ultimately, the goal for Airbus here is to develop a low risk competitor to the 787. What we've seen in the past is that airplane, new airplane development gets very, very expensive very, very quickly. What Airbus is hoping to do is take the existing A330 platform, which is a, a long-range airplane that they've had uh, in service since the early 90s, add a new engine without the risk of developing all new systems, an all new airframe, uh, to really capture the benefit of what they're touting is 14% better fuel efficiency for the airplane, to really sell it to uh, airlines that are more cost conscious as far as not needing all of the performance of an all new airplane, but still getting uh, the, the cost benefit of a, a an aircraft that really has better fuel efficiency than the, the existing model. The emergence of these new details about the A330neo come just ahead of the Farnborough Air Show. Ultimately, it's at this point really a question of whether or not this concept and these details become re a reality and whether or not Airbus begins to actually launch the A330neo with commitments from airlines and lessers here at the show.